Hello and welcome back to my channel and welcome to day 13 of May I Scrap Lift You. And today I'm doing something a little bit different, something that you've seen me do before, but I haven't done in a little bit and I really wanted to get, get back into it. Um, and that is using either a sketch or a layout and using it as inspiration for a six by eight double page that's going to go into my Me, Myself and I uh, 2021 album. And today I have a layout, a lovely, lovely layout by my dear friend Ronnie. She's Ronnie Suit Scrapper here on YouTube. Uh, and of course her channel will be linked down below. And Ronnie, oh, what I really wanted to do, and I did, I do actually have a couple of them in my file, was try and honor her and pay tribute to her awesome talent with paper piecing, punches, dies. She does the most absolutely gorgeous little critters or items or trees. It's just, I mean, I'm sure you're all following uh, Ronnie, and you know exactly what I'm talking about, but if by any chance you don't, get right on over to that channel as soon as you've done watching this video. But in the end, I chose this lovely layout because I really, as you know from my How to Kill a Kit with Style this month, um, I tried to get myself set up to get at least six double space, double uh, page spreads into that album and this layout lends itself perfectly to that kind of transformation if you just turn it onto its side so as I always do of course on the right hand side I use the Nicole Jones 911 uh, uh, printables the grid paper this is the medium grid I always use that as my right hand page so I can do all of my journaling the left-hand page is the decorated page or the scrapbook page. And I think I managed to stay fairly closely, at least in spirit, to Ronnie's layout. My photo is not portrait, it's landscape. And then, of course, with the smaller real estate, this lovely um, strip down here is a little bit narrow. So my, fo my photo, of course, of course juts right out onto the background pattern paper but I still love it you still see the items down here um, on the side and then the embellishment around in a similar fashion to Ronnie did I think if you look at this you definitely see that side of the layout I am using uh, the Paige Evans Go the Scenic Route, and the Wonders Collection. And I'm not quite sure which comes from where. I think this comes from Wonders. And I think I think both of the papers actually come from the Wonders Collection uh, on this particular layout. A couple of stickers, the floral stickers, so I could get some florals in there the way that Ronnie did. Just pop this up here. The best, these are... This is a collage of photos I did when I used to go to the country for a month every summer when my sister from another Mr. and her ex-husband lived in the country. They would go away for a month. I would go tend the garden and we had a joint massive, massive garden project at the time. And then I got some little stars and flowers out from the Bella Boulevard, the lovely Bella Boulevard collection. Um, that my dear friend Colleen had sent to me at Christmas. And then if I bring this over onto this side, again, you can see that I replicated. Now I added, I have the strip down here the way Ronnie does, of course, but then I added just so that I could repeat the paper from this side of the page as well. I repeated the little scallop border here. And then I used that area for my title the way Ronnie did. So something I missed, which is the prompt. Um, as you know, the Me, Myself and I 2021 uh, project 
is a series of prompts start, uh, that uh, the lovely Heba from My Little Journal did in January. She did it through the entire month of January, so 31 prompts in 31 days. I am spreading it out over the year, as are my friends Amy and Becky. I will have their channels linked down below as well, linked to their playlist for this specific project. Um, so that gave, so I put the title here, which is simply the prompt, something I miss, because I really, really do miss the large garden and being able to spend my days in the garden. Um, it's so very, very relaxing. It's another hobby of mine, not, <laughs> at, well, certainly not now to the same extent as scrapbooking, but pretty much on an even keel when I was able to do it on a more regular basis. Whereas now my garden is somewhat of just a terrace garden, but it's still a little garden and I still get to get my hands dirty every once in a while. Now, I did the same sort of embellishing here, a little bit of deconstructed. I used some of the puffy stickers uh, from, uh, I think it is the Wonder Collection, or is it Go the Scenic Route? I don't remember, I get them, because now I've put them a little bit together. Uh, some of the embellishments, I'm not quite sure. Now, I took this sticker out, Amazing, which I popped there, and oh my God, I, that's it, it was not coming back up, so, the shade is not quite right. The word definitely is. I, I, If I had been able to remove it, I think I would have, but I was not able to, so we leave amazing there. And then I added, and memories. Oh, I just noticed the end part. I thought it was just memories. So we'll just have to pop a little something on there so that it just says, amazing memories. Down here, beautiful moments, and a couple of other. Now, this, of course, is added by virtue of the way my page is is lying so I've put this down here and then the journaling here is um, a little bit more personal so I've not done the journaling here for you to see on camera and will not be doing it either when I share over on Instagram and in Facebook but I am going to get my journaling done as soon as I am done this video so thank you thank you for the lovely inspiration Ronnie as always always. Um, I love, love, love your channel. I love our chats. And please make sure you pop on down below and see what everybody else has to share with you today. Go see Amy and Becky and their Me, Myself and I uh, project. And uh, of course, pop on over and make sure you follow Ronnie if you're not already doing so. And I will be back here tomorrow with day 14. Bye for now, my friends. Thanks for being here.